Hello, we are here for one more lesson of this TFLEX CAD training course and the topic uh, for today will be the pages. And uh, what is uh, these uh, pages? Um, TFLEX uh, is a system that uh, for working convenience provides the capability of creating multi-page documents. Uh, example. Um, it is very handy to have uh, uh, in just one file, but uh, on separate pages, auxiliary 2D constructions used in main 3D model, as well as projections or sections of the 3D model with dimensions, with builds of materials, whatever you want. Okay, this is the the philosophy of work uh, in TFLEX. So. Um, we have this uh, page and we can create new pages uh, inside here. So we can do this uh, creation of the new pages in several ways. The first way is to uh, click on the page down key in your keyboard. So if I click on the page down, so I will get, um, I will get this dialog box, create a new page. I will say yes. And uh, you see here below page one, page two, because before I had only one page, it was page one, so uh, it was not shown. Now I have uh, a page two. Uh, there is one other possibility uh, to create a new page. And for that, you just click P, G, and you get this dialog box. In here, you manage everything about the pages. And you can see that uh, when we create a new page, you can uh, give it a name and you can say uh, what is the page type. So you have several page types, okay? You can split uh, the page types according to these uh, categories. So you can give it, for example, auxiliary. And then you can filter these uh, types of pages for being shown or not. So I will say everything it is shown, but I can filter. And I can manage these pages by creating new ones, copy, delete, rename, uh, changing the order, whatever. So just say this. Um, we manage the information inside these pages uh, or we manage the access to these pages uh, just clicking on the page, okay? It's very easy. Uh, another important idea about these pages is that uh, each, each page has its own configuration. So uh, inside one page, if I say um, ST, I get uh, uh, this uh, configuration, okay? And in here, I can configure, uh, so I can use one of these. Uh, I can configure regarding the page uh, a lot of things and I can change it for this page, for example, saying in this one I want uh, A4, okay, uh, and on this one if I do the same procedure, I will configure um, the page that I'm choosing, okay, uh, sorry, I made the enter, it was not needed. Um, so the configuration uh, it's done page by page. The other uh, important topic about this is um, that we can uh, share information between the pages and the information is independent from page to page. For example, this page two, if I create something, so I can create uh, an entity, for example, a circle, now, if I go and say uh, translate, I can choose this circle. Okay, a base point, it can be, okay, this one. So I can copy this uh, in my, in, in the same page, but I can click in one of the other pages and you see that I can share easily the information between the pages, okay? This is valid for uh, any type of elements. So it is also very convenient to uh, work like this. 
for last uh, the idea of the pages and we will see that uh, along the course is because we have a lot of different uh, types of information to create uh, on the 2D. I mentioned uh, in the beginning of the lesson builds on materials, we can create uh, controls for the parametrics of the file, um, we can create a kind of a mini CAD environment also to control uh, what is um, done in the in the in this to this side so and this split in terms of pages um, in the same drawing it's very convenient and very easy to work with and to understand so um, I hope this was uh, clear enough so that you can start using this uh, anyway as you know already uh, any questions or any uh, topics that uh, you need some help, you can contact us.